Hello, and welcome back to Let's Play City Skylines Rockwood Episode 11. I'm your host, Fairville. Last episode, we built a new farming industry that started driving up our residential demand. With the new train stops in place, we were able to grow new high-density residential areas and add park pathways for greater access and to drive up revenue. For this episode, we're going to expand our low-density residential so we can level up to get a new square and build a trade school or university. Don't forget, if there's anything you'd like to see built in Rockwood, leave a comment below. If you're enjoying the series, don't forget to like and subscribe. Alright, let's go. map it looks like uh we've run out of squares to buy for now and we have to wait till we get to the next level we're not too far away looks like we have about 1500 more in population we need to add so we can get another square i was initially hoping that we'd come down this way and expand out those neighborhoods we initially built at the beginning of the game but instead how about we come to that square we just bought to start putting down our farm Looking over here, I thought it'd be kind of neat if we tried to build another beach area, maybe down in this end after we build some homes coming through the neighborhood. I know in my first video I mentioned that we weren't going to make it super dense, so in this area I think I'll put down mostly low density homes with maybe a few high density ones as well. The shoreline's a little difficult to build by, so I'm going to try adding a quay. These quays, they're a little bit of a finish to the shoreline. It helps flatten out the area. going to use the move it mod to bring it in line with the quay. I downloaded this local beach asset from the workshop marks the area uh, for the sims to use is kind of like a park so I'll put a couple down right here
We should probably also add some sand to our beach. Sand on this map, it's a little bit gritty, but it'll be all right. Looks like we have a ton of people coming to check out the new neighborhood already. Probably has something to do with our connection. We'll touch that up. to this area that we haven't even developed yet. I had this cool little ramp walkway down here. Take a look. Nice gradual decline behind the garden. Two. This little valley takes us down to our piers. You can see the train farms across the river. You'll notice we have the beach connected up with walkway to get people across the street. We also kept the park pathway separate. Kind of helps us make a little more money in the game. So when they come out of the park, you have to pay to go in to get to the beach access. Let's add a few more fun elements to our beach. Looks like that stall is just going to be dirty. <laughs> I think I made it worse. decorated a little bit. Welcome to Riverside Beach. Still have a lot of residential demand, so 
We should probably go in and fill in our residence. Big city, we've made that 15,000. We're really gonna be able to keep building those suburbs that we talked about and get that university going. So that's gonna do it for this episode of Let's Play City Skylines Rockwood. Well, hey, I really appreciate y'all coming out, having a blast. I hope you are too. 